Hi, so this session is specially for the environment variable configuration. So let me introduce what is the environment variable first. So let's say my computer properties. We have uh, advanced system settings here, environment variable tab. So ultimately the upper list box shows the user variables for my login and the lower list so the system variables for uh, my login page so as of now what i will be doing i will be just adding one environment variable in my in existing installer and uh, one environment variable which will be the same as this one and uh, for the user variable and one of them for this one and will create new uh, user variable and the new system variable and will verify how to uh, what to do when there are installation phase or when there is a uninstall phase like these things so let's do it so what i'm doing is that right now i'll just maybe confirm one more thing here i'm gonna update path variable by appending one more path which is my install dir and for this system variable i'm gonna one second i'm gonna um, update this win dir and we'll add one more one variable here and we'll add one variable here right so keep it open i will be just closing these things and will be coming so to my installer yes so to create an environment or update an environment variable we have to come to the install designer and then there is a system configuration and then environment variables and here we will be clicking add environment variable the name would be same as the name of existing one if we are trying to update the existing one right so this is the path so i'm typing this one path now component is i just want to associate my component with this variable so that that component is if that component gets installed or installed all these environment variable will be affected impacted right so i am choosing exe file now the value would be Take the backup of this value first. Just to stop any kind of disaster. Right. Now, the value would be install dir. Right. On install, we need to set it. Uh, placement will be appended. So, we need to append this value. So I am assuming that the value as of now is this. Now later on this value will be this. After here will be the path of install dir, right? Okay. Uninstall. We need to remove this path variable. We need to remove this inner variable on uninstall. And that should be the user type, right? Correct. That would be user type variable, right? I will be adding one more environment variable. The name would be windir. Not windir. I'm just using tmp, right? So tmp variable. Tmp, right? So this is also associated to my executable component and the value for this would be like this one, the value which is already here and I will append the installed dir as well, right? So this, that will be my final value. Just take a backup of this and that. Now here I am writing install dir right. 
this will be set we have more options like set create remove so set means if the entry already exists then we need to set if the entry does not exist then we need to create or add a set so for that case we can use create for removal we can use this one right so i'm using set as of now we have a few options like append if it takes replace so if we are setting or creating that means we need to provide the way how the value would be set so whether we want to append the new value to the existing one or whether we want to prefix the new value to the existing one or whether we want to replace the whole value of existing one by a new value right so i am just going to append and this would be my system right i am saving it i am just adding one more variable which is user voila user voila the type of this would be user and it is ready to be configuration and value would be voila user one right i am setting it and right again i will be adding one more environment variable that would be system valla and for the system valla i will use the same component and value will be system valla one set up and this will be system right system user this will be system this will be user so as you can see now uh, let me just build this first so as you can see now we don't have user valla or system valla kind of variables in the list see properly right i am expecting these two do variables in here here only really for the list one will we get updated right so let me try to install the application first and one more thing whether there is any application already installed or not no there is no any application with the same portfolio over here so next Then right now those things updated. I will just canceling it again, opening it. So just verifying the existing value like path. So for path, the value is like this is the existing one. Let me show you the existing value. So for the user one, this was the existing value, and the new one has been added, right? now for the tmp variable in the system one this is the value and uh, new value which is this has been appended no other variable got affected right uh, right i think this is also not got affected correct this is also not got affected so we can verif we have verified that the existing variable are getting updated now for the new variables let's me come to the user villa user villa user villa so we have this user villa variable with the well villa user one and we have system villa right system villa and system villa right so all those variables has been added and updated accordingly now i will be just uninstalling the same application and verifying whether the changes has been reported in the environment variables or not so let me try to uninstall the application and 
verify the environment variable so so I am expecting user wala should not be there correct system wala should not be there correct here path variable should be corrected back to its right value correct and tmp variable should be verified properly whether it is getting corrected or not right so this is the use of environment variable sometimes what happens uh, you can either use registry or you can use environment variables so environment variables is different so you can just uh, verify see on the google like how to use environment variables and when to use environment variables when to use right so we will read few links here So this way uh, you can specify like how to use our environment variable, right? So this is the demo has been done for the recommendation purpose. So there is only one uh, recommendation like whenever we add any path variable, environment variable, then maybe sometimes there we have some kind of path variable especially for the environment. So we need to check whether this is any issue is getting created by adding new path value, new environment value or not. So see that's why I have seen right. So that's done. Thanks.